it ain't no gatekeeping around here. When I get it, you get it, okay? And if I don't got it, I don't got it. I don't have no reason to hold y'all up. I always check that description. No gatekeeping here, bro. I want y'all to be cute, too. That's why I'm doing this. <laughs> Hey babes, if you are new here, my name is Ashley. Welcome to my channel. If you've been here, hey girl. If you are new here, again, hey girl, what's up? Make sure that you are subscribing, hitting that notification, like, comment, subscribe. Do all that good stuff. Y'all know the deal, y'all know the spiel. So today, I'm actually going to do a quick haul just to give you guys the update of some of the things that I've been buying online because fall season is here. Online shopping is real and i told y'all once before this is not a minimalist account this is very much maximalist i just have a shopping problem i do so you know um i just find myself buying little things here and there some of this stuff is just like little one twos some of this is just stuff that i just saw it was cheap and i got it or it was cute or it was necessary but anyway before we get into this fashion haul, let's talk about who I am and why you're here. Again, my name is Ashley. Pleased to meet you. I am actually the owner and writer for a blog called eatandbougie.com. Eatandbougie.com is a platform geared toward what I like to call the bad babe lifestyle. Basically, in my eyes, I feel like we are all babes. We live life effortlessly without regret. You do whatever you want to do, however you want to do it. And I'm just here to promote that. So on eatandbougie.com, you're actually going to find very similar content to what's here on the YouTube channel. Um, outfit inspiration heavy. Um, you're going to find really good places to eat, cool things to do in the city that I live, which is Jacksonville, Florida. So you can always subscribe there if you want to keep um, up with the updates. Or you could just check it from time to time. I'm very frequent. I post there all the time. In addition to the website, you can find me on all social media, including Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and Pinterest, which is one of my favorites. So without further ado, all of that, let's go ahead and get into this fashion haul. So I guess we'll just kind of break this down by like category. So um, I guess I'll start with accessories because I have the most of those. But anyway, um, I actually already wore this, but I wanted to show you guys on the channel because I don't feel like I gave this bag enough credit. It actually came from JWP or Pi. I say Pi because that just kind of makes sense. And I probably could look it up and see how it sounded, but whatever. Y'all know what it is. This this brand right here, I first saw them like on Amazon, but when I say y'all, they have been showing out for the season. They have more than a few picks that I am wanting, but I actually grabbed this baby. Um, it comes in this really nice box. It also had a dust bag. I don't know where it's at because I'm like so bad with like my dust bags. I had it in there. I was kind of having a whole hissy fit the other day about something to wear and it got, okay, whatever. So this is the bag. This is actually the Abacus um, mini bag. So as you can see, this thing is sparkly. It is crystal. It is everything. She is so cute. Um, when I wore this, I'm going to insert a picture somewhere of the outfit, but when I wore this, I wore this to a fashion show recently, and I got so many compliments on this little bag. Um, it is worth, I believe it's like $129 um, on Amazon. It might be a hair cheaper, but when I tell y'all, I got so many compliments, and I had so much fun with this bag and the look that, yeah, so I'm definitely excited to wear this more than a few times you guys know metallics as well as crystals it's like the it thing right now um in the fashion world so definitely am happy with that purchase now um in the same night i actually wanted to wear some really dramatic earrings because the fashion show that i went to was the all black like formal situation so i had like this fishtail gown i mean y'all just saw the picture but in addition i had these earrings on one now these came from akira i absolutely love akira um shopakira.com these are basically like some fishbone earrings but what made me love them was the length of them so as you can see they are 
super long they pretty much come to the shoulder so they go from the earlobe past the shoulder um another showstopper head turner hey girl where you get these from um i absolutely love these definitely will be wearing these again as well can't say i wear them with the bag again but you guys will definitely see me rock these babies again so um while we're on the topic of earrings okay when i was at the fashion show that i'm referring to i actually found um they had vendors selling items so this is a brand i believe it's black owned called bijou and basically these are the earrings so as you can see they are like triangles and they look like they would be really heavy but here's the deal they are super lightweight um because they are made from coconut shells so these are 100 percent handmade covered coated it's like they put some type of epoxy on top to kind of give it a shine but i y'all when i tell y'all i can't wait to show my behind and wear these i have really been into like dramatic earrings lately so these totally fit the bill so be looking out for these of course everything i'm talking about i'm gonna link it for y'all y'all ain't gotta be like where the links at sis they gonna be right at the bottom and don't be sending me no comments asking me where i got it from check the description if you just don't happen to not see it then holler at me but i am here for you boo i am here for you let me be your plug to get this hot stuff it ain't no gatekeep around here when i get it you get it okay and if i don't got it i don't got it i don't have no reason to hold y'all up I always check that description no gatekeeping here bro i want y'all to be cute too that's why i'm doing this but anyway moving right along so still in the accessory department um for some reason i have been like obsessed with silver accessories and y'all know she and be real cheap um they just be having cute little throwaway stuff so i have been buying like all kind of silver accessories so I just got this order in. I'm gonna run through these items real quick. Just some cute little um, everyday little accessories, earrings, um, necklaces, bracelets, super cute. And I think each one of these were definitely under $5 each though. Um, first up we have these, these little um, hoops and they kind of look like crushed metal. They just caught my attention because aside from them being silver, I don't really, and I know I'm contradicting what I said. I know I like the dramatic earrings, but just like for day-to-day -day stuff, um, I do like to wear smaller pieces too, um, just depending on the setting, depending on what I'm wearing. So all these earrings are gonna be really small that I'm gonna show you guys. So definitely um, have these, as you can see, they fit super small, um, but they are really cute. Um, next up, I don't even know why. I don't even know why I bought these, but basically these are like some drip style earrings. And let me stop playing. I know why I bought them because if you look how they look on my ear, they're super cute. They're dainty, they're stylish, and they're just some little thrown pieces because I realize I don't have like a whole lot of options for um, small earrings. I usually just go with the same pair of studs. So definitely just trying to switch it up. Um, there are a few little gold ones that I've ordered as well, but this is what came in time for y'all. So there y'all go. Um, now this next pair, child, I thought that they were bigger because y'all know like everybody been going crazy about the Bottega teardrop earrings. Um, and of course, you know, the dupes. And I already had a smaller pair, a silver pair, but these are basically um, from Shein. These are literally the same ones I have. I thought that these were gonna be more of the medium size because I have the large gold ones, but I don't have the medium or large silver ones. So I thought these were that because that's what the picture show. So that's why you gotta be careful sometimes with Shein because you know, they, they pull stuff like that. But these are smaller. I'm not really mad because these are like that accessory, like why not have a few, you know, they just, they are so cute right now and they are so hot and in the event my other ones get to tarnishing i gotta back up okay and honestly i think i might like these better than the ones that i got from amazon because they are really silver if you can look on the video that i inserted they are super super silver so 
super silver. Let's go. Um, next I have this little cuff. Um, for this to be Shein, this is actually pretty heavy. Um, it's way more heavier than I intended, and I know I said everything was under five, but I think this one might have been like six or seven dollars. Um, but I'm gonna just drop the insert, but it basically just opens at the wrist and cuffs, and I just thought this would just be um, a cute little cuff to put on with some other accessories to do what I need to do, baby. So, shout out to Shein. And then last but not least, I have this little, again, buying the little drip stuff. This is like a choker style necklace. Um, so as you can see, it fits um, really tight like a choker. Um, it does have adjustments, but I definitely would be wearing it like a choker. Again, maybe the ads just kept popping up on Shein and I just kept adding it to the cart. So that's how I ended up with all these random things. Um, so one more pair of earrings and this is just a super miniature um, hoop kind of chunky um, again very small but I have these little hoops I'm gonna just drop them in the um, drop an insert in so you guys can really see them but again just finding cute little dainty pieces just for little go on accessories so that's all the jewelry that I have for this haul now one more accessory back to the fashion show um as you guys know i told you before i have a wide foot so if you have a wide foot too i'm your go-to to find the cute shoes um it's just no secret that asos has a really huge selection of like wide fit heels and shoes so if you're someone like me that you know i can do a narrow shoe but it's like i just i'm at a place in life i want to be comfortable so i look for things that match that so basically same fashion show um i got these heels and basically i bought them because i knew i was going to be doing a lot of walking so the heel wasn't crazy tall but it's also not a kitten heel i guess this is what a three inch heel i'm at a place in life a three inch heel is fine like it's okay let's do it you know why because i was able to walk around all night i was not living i was not in pain and these so happen to be pretty comfortable so as you can see they have like the diamond stud detail they have the black sole and then they are clear definitely definitely gonna be rocking these a lot this season so let's go ahead and move on to clothes still in the shin bag um i was just looking randomly looking for a sheer um bomber style jacket with like a drawstring and they just so happen to have this one um when it comes to shan i am obsessed with their daisy line um they stuff just be super cute and so far i have not had any issues with the daisy line i will say that it is asian sizing so normally i do a medium and everything i do get a large so take that into consideration. Their stuff does run a little bit smaller, um, but of course just check the size chart to see what you can fit. Could I have done a medium in this? Probably, but the large just fits perfect. So basically I have this um, sheer um, bomber style jacket, just like I said. The thing that I love about it, the sleeves um, have the elastic, so they can be kind of bunched up. I'm gonna drop in the video. And um, the bottom has a tie to do exactly what I wanted it to do, which is uh, cinch at the waist so it can be worn. I haven't quite figured out what I'm gonna do with this, but I just felt like this was one of the pieces that was necessary to be in my closet to do something. I don't know what, but again, I told y'all this like the shopaholic in me. So yeah. Still on Shein in the sheer department, found this super cute. Um, this is like a see-through mesh top. Um, it kind of is like asymmetrical a little bit, meaning that the hem is kind of uneven. They did that on purpose. It's long sleeve, it's lightweight. Um, the only coral that I probably have with this, but it's not too bad, it does have shoulder pads in it, I guess just to kind of give it like an edgy look. So we'll see how that works. I actually have an outfit in mind um, that I want to wear this with. So I don't know 
a matter of fact i think i know how i'm gonna wear this um y'all will probably see the get ready with me with this before you guys see this video so if so be sure that you are checking my shorts on youtube but of course if you follow me on all the other platforms it's on there as well it'll be on there um to show how i actually plan on doing this look so and again, I think this shirt was like under $10. So that's the cool thing about Shein. I know it's like no, no to buy like the non-sustainable stuff, but let's just be clear. Sometimes they just be having the cute little, the cute little one twos for the low low. So you could just be cute right quick. But that's everything for Shein. Let's go ahead and move on to the next brand. So this is actually my last um, couple of pieces, I think. Yeah, this is it. Um, this actually came from Micah's. Micah's is actually one of my favorite overseas brands right now. Um, pluses, they stuff is very reasonable. The quality is good. Um, it's not Zara quality, but it's better than Shein. No hate to Shein. Let me stop. I gotta stop doing that, but I, that's the only comparison that I can give you guys. Um, it's kind of like, it's good quality. Um, the only issue that I have with Micah's, oh, and also their sizing is pretty on key. Um, I do wear a medium. I told you guys I'm a dress size six, medium all the way across the board when it comes to like juniors, I guess. Um, I do a medium. So I order a medium. I haven't had any issues with sizing, no quality issues. The only problem that I have with them, it does take a while for the stuff to ship. However, they do do express and expedited shipping. Now, this particular um, package, I did expedited shipping. It doesn't really say how long it's gonna take. So it ended up taking um, about a week and a half. So just keep that in mind. If you need it really quick, I have not executed their express shipping. Um, the expedite did take a, a week and a half and I did miss the deadline that I needed this piece, specifically the dress. But anyway, I'm gonna just show y'all the stuff. This is a pair of asymmetrical hem or button jeans, meaning that they button up regular, but they kind of have a little slant and I'm gonna just drop the insert in. Um, the reason why these caught my attention is because I love a medium wash jean. Also, I have a lot of jeans that are destroyed. So I really just wanted like a medium width opening um, jean that didn't have any rips and tears. Just kind of like a more everyday, every style kind of jean, especially with the colder months coming. Although you can do destroy jeans, I just don't want my kneecaps being cold. So I wanted to have a cute pair of jeans. Um, these actually fit okay. I did go up a size and I did a large. Um, specifically because the size chart basically told me to. So they do have the recommended size chart based off of your measurements and it told me to get a large, they fit perfect. I don't see me needing to get these tailored to the waist or any of that. They do kind of have a little smash in at the booty, if y'all know what I mean, because these do not have any stretch. So if you want to get these, keep that in mind. These are 100% cotton, but as far as the length, they are the perfect length. I'm 5'2", um, so they're not too long, but they're not too short either. So they give me a little bit of leeway if I want to do heels with them or if I just want to rock out with a pair of sneakers. Um, I also love these because the quality is really good on this pair of jeans. Like they are heavy, they are real, and they are yes. So <laughs> moving right along. Um, last but of course not least, I got this um, one shoulder maxi dress. It kind of has like that fading. I don't really know. Like ombre. That's the that's the word I'm looking for. It has the ombre effect. Um, the reason why I love this dress is because it is so in alignment with fall. It kind of has that rust burnt orange at the top, then it fades into like a brown, then a dark brown, then it comes back out um, into like light and then yellow. The thing I love about this, um, I'm more than likely gonna wear some brown boots with it. That's what I intended on wearing when I ordered it. But I also love that it has the lighter colors so I can go with a lighter pair of shoes um to try different colors and looks with this outfit um but as you can see it fits perfect this is a size medium just like i told you guys um the length is great and um it's just a cute quality dress and i mean for the price i really can't complain so definitely loving this one and i love micah so they have more than a few things i just 
I like the website. So basically that's everything that I have for you guys today. Like I said, it wasn't a crazy large haul. It was just a little update of a few things that I've been buying. Um, of course, like I already told y'all, the description is, the link is going to be in the description. So don't worry about that. Um, I have ordered all of this stuff within the last month. So hopefully it's still online. So of course, if you are loving today's content, if you are loving these pieces, let me know which one you like the most. Of course, drop your girl some comments, hit that like button, let me know that you're liking this stuff because I can keep going because I'm gonna shop. I don't have no problem showing you guys what I'm getting. So that's actually it for today. I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. Once again, if you're loving today's content, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button so you can be locked in with the BBL, the Bad Babe Lifestyle, to keep up with everything that's going. I always post the fashion videos, fashion content on Wednesday, and then every Sunday you can expect a vlog, just kind of like a day in the life hand crazy-ish. So I love you guys the most. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next video.